welcome back to part two of our six days at Six Flags vacation. Quick recap, on day one, we got soaked on the tsunami soaker, but stuck on the sky screamer. Day two, we found dead Bob Rosses and Christian got the high score on the Justice Hall ride, but he got sick on the Superwoman ride. Day three brought historic flooding and an unexpected rest day when the park closed. Join us for the last three days of our six days at Six Flags St. Louis. Unfortunately, Christian was not feeling well on day four because it was hands down the best day we were there. Jelly Belly. Literally got here and there is nobody here. No one. It's a Wednesday afternoon. We're it. Look at that. There's like nothing here. After a quick pick with Jelly Belly, we decided to head off to the Colossus, the giant Ferris wheel. Be nice, Ellie. Say hi. hi. Aw, how nice. <laughs> Ellie and Macy, go. I mean, Ellie and Marissa, go. <laughs> All right, ready? Okay, now we're headed to the Colossus. It's a giant Ferris wheel and it's kind of slow, but pretty cool. All right, here we go. The views from the top are worth the ride. Since we still had Quinn with us, we decided to head to Bugs Bunny National Park for some kitty rides. Did you find your own? Oh, it matches your hair. All right, we are in front of the Mount Rushmore Bugs Bunny. The big girls could not ride all the rides, but Quinn could, and she loved it. And then it was time for a dance party. Honestly, this was one of our favorite things the entire week. If you want to make sure that you don't miss out on fun activities like this, be sure to download the Six Flags app when you come to the park. It gives you which rides are open, which rides are closed, and it tells you about extra special things like shows and dance parties. It makes your day a lot more fun. On our first day, we got stuck on the Sky Screamer, but today, the ride worked perfectly and the girls loved it. Definitely became one of our favorite rides. After a quick ride on the boomerang, we headed over for an extra special treat. The Miss Kitty Show. This was one of my favorite things as a child and it had been closed for a long time. We were so excited to see that they brought it back this season. The girls and I all loved the show and it was so much fun to watch the dancers and the singers. They did a great job. By the way, we found out about the show because of the app, so make sure to download it. And then it was time to finally take advantage of those super short lines and go ride all the rides. We were successful at finishing all 21 rides that day.
Our 21st ride was the Catwoman Whip. It's this season's brand new ride, and the line for this is actually pretty long, even on a short day, so we were glad to get to finally ride this one. The Catwoman Whip. You survived? You liked it? I don't think I liked it. Okay. She's got a mark on her leg. All right, good job guys, come on out. I was blind the first way because my eyelashes kept sticking together, and I was blind huh. the other way because my bangs were in my face. Huh, maybe we just shave you bald, you won't have a problem. I would not look good bald. <laughs> It's National Water Park Day, and well, I wanted to participate. <laughs> this is what we got as soon as we got here. Water. Just not in the right place. Water in the park, not the water park. The water park is closed. The Six Flags is, is open, but. <laughs> None of the rides are running right now. So we're sitting here debating whether or not we should go, like, sit here for a while and have the park to ourselves, or if we should just go home or do something else. We haven't figured that out yet. We can go get ice cream. But anyway, so here we are at Six Flags. We do have a front row parking spot, except for the preferred parking people. So that's kind of nice. What was your favorite ride today, guys? The car ride. Water ride. <laughs> The yeah. water ride? What water ride was that? The sky. The bathroom. Yeah, we went to the bathroom. We got out and used their bathroom, found out what was going on, and here we sit. So there you are. Skies are a little bit ominous looking. Moments later, it started pouring. So the park was closed and we had to find something else to do. All right, since it's raining, we decided to finally stop at I don't know if it's as much fun in the rain as it is when it's sunny out. You cannot get a very good view of it. You guys, it's like pouring out. And this is the light rain. We ended up spending the day at Wally's and then a local sculpture park, both of which will get their own videos in the near future. But we had to wait out the rain and then there was flash flooding on the roads. But we had a great afternoon anyways. On our last day at the park, there were a ton of people and it was really hot, so we decided to go to the water park first. We also decided not to do much filming that day. Then we finished off the day riding some of our favorite rides one last time, and we went out with a bang. Or something. We are stuck! What was your score? Amaris is vlogging it too, but this is worthwhile to vlog, so. Yeah. We only got to the first screen. We hope we get to play again, but we might be done for the night. Oh well. Now it's moving. We tried. Everybody say hi. Oh well. Oh, maybe, maybe it's not closed. Maybe it got, it broke. I know. Oh, so here's what it looks like in the light. Shipping and receiving. We're stuck. We're kind of neat in here. That's how it looks behind you. For our final ride, we're stuck. That's it. <laughs> I don't think we're gonna get to go anywhere else. We're gonna just stay here. Good news is it's air conditioned. We're not upside down. We're not. There's a lot of places that you could be stuck that would be bad, and this isn't too bad. We are getting shot at. Bye. 
handgun. We got unstuck with just enough time to ride one last ride. We cannot tell you how much fun we had this week. Even though we only ended up with four days to play, we had an awesome time and we are so glad that we made this our vacation last summer. We highly recommend it. Bye.